for you, Kyle, is it bittersweet to be around football but to not be playing? How has that transition been for you? It's definitely a change. You get a little bit of the urge to get out there and, and uh, throw it around a bit, but um, football is a game I love. I'm not playing, I would definitely want to be in a coaching role. You chose not to play and not to go to camp with Montreal. Was that a difficult decision for you? Oh yeah, definitely. Definitely a difficult decision. I, you know, every, anyone who was close to me, I, I made sure they were involved in the process and got some feedback and obviously it was, you know, out of left field for a lot of people and why would anyone walk away from, from something like that when people were fighting so hard to get that same, same situation? But. Um, obviously, you know, I've been in a couple camps now. There's, there's more to the situation as it appears to the average guy. I think there is a bias against quarterbacks at the next level. Uh, I, I certainly, uh, like a lot of other people, thought he was a guy that could change that bias. It's been a long time since we've seen a Russ Jackson run around the CFL and, and have success, uh, and I hope that changes soon. But it was something I, you know, I felt pretty strongly about, so I figured I'd, I'd follow my heart. Given the injuries the Alouettes have had at the quarterback position, do you regret the decision at all? No, I don't regret it. No, I, you know, there's, uh, it's so easy to look back and say, you know, now, like you said, with the injuries and maybe you'd get some time, but um, when the decision was made, it, you know, it certainly wasn't looking that way. Now, there will be another CFL franchise who's going to need three quarterbacks. Have you totally closed the door on, on playing professionally? You put me on the spot in this one. <laughs> I don't know. I, you know, like I said, right now I'm I'm excited to stay involved with the game. You know, I still like throwing the ball around, so um, uh, we'll see. Were you surprised to see this guy back for you as you take your first journey into being a starter at OUA football? I was more excited than anything else, to be honest. He's uh, he was a great uh, teacher to me when he was the starter here, and I, I learned more than I ever thought I would from him when I when I was his backup. So. To have him back on the sidelines and have him as a, as a resource for me every day is uh, something I, better than I could have ever imagined. 